Running for her life, a woman flees through the car park just after midnight after her partner pulled a knife, threatening to kill her, accusing her of cheating on him. He drives out of the car park and for a brief moment she suspects this crazed argument might be over. Then the SUV mounts the footpath and rockets towards her across the car park, stopping only after smashing two bollards. Behind the wheel, 28-year-old Abbas al Kafaji. The diagnosed schizophrenic is off his medication and high on marijuana. So enraged at first, he forgets to grab his weapon, the knife he's brought with him on the passenger seat. She makes a dash into the restaurant and begs them to lock the doors, but it's too late. All she can do is cower in the kitchen as he threatens again and again to kill her. McDonald's staff bolt from the area. She takes hold of whatever she can find, a single broomstick, her only physical defence, as she tries to talk her partner down. That's the knife in his right hand as he closes in. As Al Kafaji threatened to kill her, she said, this is all in your head. You're going to hurt me. Please stop. She believed he was going to stab her, but then the unexpected. Suddenly, something changes and Al Kafaji backs away and walks out, leaving his car behind at first. He then returns and drives off, again over the footpath. Months later, while held on remand, despite an AVO preventing him contacting his ex, Al Kafaji rings. She says, you shouldn't be talking to me. You tried to kill me. He says, weren't you happy I did that because it shows I'm serious about you? Al Kafaji has pleaded guilty to a string of offences. The most serious carries a maximum of 12 years jail. He will be sentenced in May. Evan Batten, 7 News.